8 Tips for Troubleshooting Desktop Widgets on Mac OS Sonoma Enable Location Services Go to the Apple menu by clicking on the Apple logo. Select System Settings. Go to Privacy and Security Settings and click Location Services. You'll see a list of apps. Turn on Location Services for the app whose widget is not working. Enter the password. Re-add the widget. Right-click or double-click on the widget you want to remove and select Remove Widget. Right-click or double-click on your desktop and select Edit Widget. Choose the widget you want to add again and click on Done. Restart Mac A device restart is almost always a great solution to fix any problem. We'll reset the system and get rid of errors acquired within the session. Check Network Connection Click on the Control Center icon Click on the Wi-Fi icon to disconnect Wait a few seconds and click the Wi-Fi again to turn it on Allow iPhone Widgets Click on the Apple logo and select System Settings Go to Desktop and Dock Settings Turn on the Use iPhone Widgets option Quit Widgets Open Spotlight by pressing the command and space keys on the keyboard. Type in Activity Monitor and open it. In the search bar, enter Widget. Select Files and click on the X icon to kill them. Then, click on Force Quit. Turn off Low Power Mode. Click on the Apple logo to access the menu and select System Settings. Go to Battery Settings. Next to Low Power Mode, click on the drop-down menu. Choose the Never option. Then, restart your Mac. Reset Notification Center. Open Spotlight by pressing the command and space keys. Type in Terminal and open it. In Terminal, enter the command line. Defaults delete com.apple.notification center UI semicolon kill all notification center. If prompted, click on Allow. Now, restart Mac. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The Disk Cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to pick up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files. Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file, a privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, subscribe to our channel.